The NSUN COVID-19 Fund nsun.org.uk forward slash nsun dash covid dash 19 dash fund In April 2020, the National Survivor User Network, NSUN, launched a fund to support community-led and user-led groups and organisations making a difference to the mental health of others in their community across England during COVID-19. Here are some of the projects we funded in their own words. Before we existed, there wasn't really a central place where you could get advice. So, so when I was 15, there was nowhere I could go if I googled LGBT traveller. Not much come up, really. So it's about, one of the things we do is just sort of simple representation, but we're trying to do more. We only launched last year at Pride in London. So we were able to start a phone line, so we sort of bought a phone and we trained up some of the people to use it so that they could kind of schedule a call with us. And we're kind of a bridge and a place where neither identity, either both matter or neither matters in a funny way, but we did that. But even more recently, it just got more funding. I'm a trained psychotherapist, and so one of the things that I've been interested in doing is putting up a psychotherapy service for travellers, because there's a lot of stigma around mental health, but there's also a lot of bad practice out there. A lot of people that don't know anything about travellers and make a lot of assumptions. We're going to be able to pay for around eight travellers to have 12 sessions of psychotherapy um, and those therapists have been chosen because they've worked with travellers before and they're going to go through some training that I'm going to provide them. So the idea is to just kind of destigmatize and demystify therapy as a thing for travellers and just to make it seem a bit more accessible. We've also set up a, um, a solidarity fund for uh, trans travellers. People can access grants of up to um, 50 quid from us to help them buy things or get treatments to help them present more uh, as their true agenda. I'm really, really glad that this thing exists and I hope that the things that we can do now more tangibly with this funding help people be less miserable than I probably was when I was 15. The Ensign COVID-19 Fund was part of a larger fund made available by the Department of Health and Social Care and managed by MIND. The Ensign COVID-19 Fund was entirely managed by Ensign. www.ensign.org.uk